Billy V, Billy Van Ambergen is with us right now. He has been out four times so far this year, uh, but this is the first time with a sprint car. He is at the ESS opener today here at a beautiful sunny afternoon here at Fulton Speedway. Of course, his sister is here. She will not be racing tonight, but she'll be back later in the season. How we been, man? We've been good. Yeah, we've been busy. Um, you know, kicked our racing off in February, did you know all modified stuff so far. And we've had this circle on the calendar for, uh, you know, to have our sprint car opener here. We're excited to get that the lid kicked off of that deal and, um, you know, going to do a little bit of both again this year. Before we go back to the modified stuff you did, how much sprint car stuff are we doing this year? I, oh, you know, it kind of depends on what the year brings and how stuff's holding up. Um, I think we're going to be able to do at least three quarters of this schedule, maybe some Patriot Sprint Store stuff, uh, a couple 305 shows. So I would put it at a range of 12 to 20 shows, depending on how the year goes. And okay. obviously we'll be full time with our modified stuff and uh, okay. Joey Barber Gallows. That was the next place car. I was going. Where? Orange at County? Orange County, racing for points there and uh, maybe Thunder Mountain a couple times throughout the summer. Okay. Um, Super Dirt Week and whatever else we can do, as long as stuff's holding up and we can continue on. Okay. How was the trip down south, and where did you go again? We went to Cherokee for Brett Deo's Elite Series opener. Um, Told me that was some good money you made down there. We made some good money there. Yeah. I mean, it made it worth our trip. It was cool to you know get that series off the ground. We may do some of that in the fall. We'll see. It's, we don't really know. We don't have a set plan other than chasing points at Orange County and as much sprint car stuff as we can, but. Um, yeah, I mean, that's a great pay and deal. We mm -hmm. got it kicked off on the right foot. We ran ninth, so we were in the top 10 um, for the first show. And uh, so that kind of sparked our interest to follow it a little more possibly. But uh, we'll just, gonna, like I said, see what the year brings. All right, so what's up for the rest of the weekend this weekend then? We'll be at Orange County tomorrow with okay. our uh, yeah, Joey Barbagallo's Escape Power Sports 4 car and uh, my buddy Matt Rigotti's number 63R small block car. Till, uh, we're still waiting on some engine parts and stuff for Joey's small block car, so he bailed us out a little bit. We're running that the first couple weeks, having some fun doing that. And uh, Joey's got a lot of great stuff in the works here and um, you know some new cars and new motors, and we're really ramping up our modified program a little bit, so we're excited about that. Very good. As far as sprints, is this a car we know or is this something new? This is something we know. Yeah, this was actually the car we won at... Uh, Eastern States weekend with the, the USAC East Coast Series. Uh, this is Mike Van Dusen's car, and this will pre pretty much be our primary car for the year when we're sprint car racing. And uh, mm -hmm. yeah, great piece. Mike's been great to work with. We get along great, and uh, nice. couldn't ask for you know a better team to go racing with. So. And it's a Panther car from here in Syracuse, huh? Yeah, this is one of the Panther cars, and uh, you know, get along with Sean Donath very well, and we uh, you know bounce some ideas off each other, and um, it just been. A, I feel like these cars kind of fit us modified guys a little bit better than mm -hmm. some primary sprint car guys. So uh, it's very cool. It's all good. 88, 86. This is an 88. 88. 88. Okay. 88, yeah. And I guess that's what's better at the longer tracks like Fulton, right? That's what. Yeah. We'll that's go what with they that. say, right? <laughs> yeah, that's what they say. So yeah, our open tonight uh, definitely gets better the slipperier it gets, and um, mm -hmm. you know we'll have to see what uh, what tonight brings. And that's a measurement between the axles, right? Between the front and the rear axles, right? Correct. 86, yep. 87, 88 yep. are the three options, right? Yep. Have you tried the others? Uh, yeah, Mike's had Panther cars for a couple of years here, and I think we've had one of each. So um, I think you can get any of them to work, but definitely some, you know, a little bit of unique differences. Very cool. Hit the blue guys and subscribe. Hope you have fun this weekend, man, and I'll, I'll be seeing you over the summer. Good luck. Yeah, sounds good, right. dude. Thanks. Thank you.